Welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I will show you how to create rotating bars in our quick announcement bar app. I have already created a bar, but I need to edit it so that it will rotate. Renaming the bar is optional. I will rename it just for my own reference so that I know that this will be a rotating bar. Now I will edit the message that will be displayed on the bar. In order for the bar to rotate, I need to change the value of the disappear after option to a number greater than zero. I want the bar to rotate every three seconds, so I'll input three in this field. Now I will save the bar. The next step will be to create a second bar. I want to keep the background color and font style consistent, so instead of creating a new bar, I will duplicate my existing one. I will now edit the second bar. Once again, editing the name field is optional. Next, I will edit the message that will be displayed on the second bar. Lastly, I will make sure that the disappear after field is also set to three. Keep in mind that in order for bar rotation to work, each bar has to target the same countries. If you are targeting all countries in the first rotating bar, you must also target all countries in all other rotating bars. If you're targeting specific countries such as Canada and the US in the first rotating bar, you must target the same two countries in all of the other rotating bars as well. By default, the order in which the bars rotate is determined by which one was created first. However, you can change the order by clicking on the Sort Rotation Order button and then dragging the bars into the preferred order. Then click on the Save Rotation Order button. Let's see how the rotating bars look on the website. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for the next video.